Hey guys, it's Bob Clark, and I want to answer a question for you that's on the minds of many, many people in our society, and that's, does size really matter? Now, um, I'm not talking about what you think I might be talking about. I'm talking about lists, list building, and um, using lists to build your business in a much bigger way. Uh, I've put together here some list building secrets that I have. Uh, I want to go through them with you really shortly, and I, then I want to show you a really cool free resource that I have for you at the end of the video. So be sure to watch it all the way to the end. So does size really matter when it comes to a list, uh, an email list? And the, and the answer is yes and no. You know, a big list is great. Um, you know, you can, you can make a lot of money off a really huge list. But having influence is really key. Um, having influence over people, um, gaining people's trust. Okay, your list, don't forget now, your list is people. Your list is not a number. Your list is not a statistic. Your list is comprised of people who have their own needs, their own wants, their own desires. And when you can build their trust, these people on, their, on your list, amazing things will happen. You know, there are two kinds of email lists. And generally, you know, people have both kinds if they're building a list. Um, kind of list plural, I guess you would, you would put it. The first one is a general kind of list, um, and, and I consider a general list to be people who don't know you when they join your list. You can get people on your list from pay-per-click, um, Craigslist, Classifieds, Facebook pay-per-click falls into this category. Any, anywhere where people will get you know, put in their name and email to, for something and they don't really know who you are. Your, your main tactic here is you're looking for product sales or affiliate offers, you know, a quick hit, if you will, to make some cash. Um, you, you can use this to get massive exposure to an amazing offer. It's, it's really very good for that kind of a thing. And where people will buy whatever you're selling without really knowing you, and they don't really care. And, and that's, that's the power of a general list. And, and it, it's quite useful in different circumstances. Then there's what I call the influence list. An influence list is kind of uh, more word of mouth referrals. Uh, people get in your list because of your own trainings or webinars. Anything from you is the reason that they're joining. They already know you when they join, and that's that's the key difference. Okay, um, could be from social media or whatever. It's a law of attraction in action. Okay, your influence list. The goal here is to gain the trust of people and to increase you. Excuse me, increase your influence. So which list is better? Well, um, if you're looking for short-term income or quick sales here and there, um, one-time sales, general list is a good thing to go with. Okay, the general list must be bigger if you want to drive significant income, and it really must be driven to an irresistible offer. Remember now, these are people who buy without knowing you, so the offer must be irresistible. If you're looking for long-term repeat buyers, residual income, maybe people join your teams, then you're looking to build your influence list. And this is the po most powerful list that I know of because you can literally build a legion of raving fans and size of this list is not as important. So let's, let's think of some questions here that you might be having. Number one, how do you build an influence list? Great question. There's certainly some tactic, tactics that you can use to build it faster. Uh, and quicker than, than usual. Number two, how do you gain people's trust, these people on your influence list? Another great question, um, and, and it's something you really must know. There's some things you must do if you want to gain people's trust. And number three, is there a way to transition people from a general list to your influence list? And the answer is yes. And I cover all of these questions in my free resource that I was telling you about in the beginning. It's called the list, my list building secrets short course. Okay, it won't take you very long to go through. It's short, as the name implies. It's totally free. Um, I'm going to show you how to build a responsive list in less time. And at the end, I'm going to give you my list building secret that saved me time and money in building my own influence list and my general list as well. Okay, if you want to um, grab this short course, just click on the link below and it'll take you to a page where you can put in your information and then you'll be able to grab this totally free List Building Secrets short course. That's all I've got for you today, guys. Uh, I'll talk to you again soon. Take care.